Merry Christmas! So as of the filming of this video, it's actually Christmas Eve, um, Christmas Eve day. But yeah, I hope you guys are having or had, depending on when this goes up, a nice Christmas Eve. And uh, so yeah, I don't know what it is. Every Christmas Eve, it seems as though I'm scrambling at the last minute, getting caught up on various tasks and things that I need to get done and get out. And so this morning I woke up early, took care of some things, finally finished uh, wrapping the giveaway gifts. Uh, so congratulations to those of you who won the giveaway. You've been contacted and I've heard back from everyone except one or two, but um, those should be sent off in the next few days. Um, so yeah, I did that and I wrapped up Tybee's Christmas presents. And uh, then I went to the gym just now and I just got out of the shower. My mom and I are probably gonna go look at some lights. I'm wearing my Rap Queen t-shirt and I've got my little festive wreath earrings from Walmart. I just made myself one of these uh, daily harvest smoothies. This banana, banana and greens one is really good. I've had a couple of these and um, it's like a banana, wheatgrass. It tells you everything that's in it. Banana, cucumber, kale, spinach, lemon, and wheatgrass. So I'm having that post-workout. It's probably gonna be all in my teeth, so I'm gonna match my earrings. <laughs> Got my cute tree in the background. Christmas came too fast this year, you guys. It like went by too fast. And I decorated starting a week before, like the week of Thanksgiving, which is pretty early for me traditionally. But I did that because I wanted the content to be up in the beginning of December when I showed you guys my decorating and whatnot. I just feel like it hasn't been up long enough. And, you know, so I don't know. I hate to be that person next year, but I may, I may decorate earlier because I just, I don't know. I just enjoy seeing it. I mean, I'm obviously going to keep it up for a few more weeks, but I'm starting to, I'm starting to see why people decorate so early. It's just nice to be festive. Anyways, yeah, um, then my mom and I, after we go look at lights and whatnot, uh, we're gonna have dinner. So, yeah, but uh, last night I actually finished opening up the advent calendar. So, I'll show you guys that footage now. Okay, we have the last few days of the advent calendar here with day 23. Looks like. I love these drawers, you guys. This calendar has been so much fun. <clears throat> All right, what is this? A lip tint, wine lip tint by Chateau Labiot. Labiot. Let's see, we'll peel off this sticker here. This. The long wearing tint dyes the lips with a bold yet delicate color that resembles quality wine while moisturizing the lips. All right, let's see what this has. I don't see any ingredients, but, oh, how cute! Oh my gosh, you guys, that is adorable. Oh my gosh, you guys, isn't that adorable? It's a little wine bottle. I love that. Oh my goodness. <laughs> How cute. <laughs> okay, I'm excited about that. Even though I'm not gonna use the lip tint, it's still pretty cute. Here, let's just put a little on. Whoa. nice. I wonder if it gets on your teeth. I wonder if it gets on your teeth like like regular wine. That's cool. All right. So we got that. What's day 24? Ooh, it looks like day 24 is something by Etude House. Uh, oh, it's an eyeshadow palette. Wow, full-size eyeshadow palette. lingerie backstage Oops, I almost drop it let's see what the colors are 
Oh, those are actually, those are actually really nice colors. They're not like hideous. I'm telling you guys, this advent calendar has been amazing. Even though I'm not a makeup wearer, the makeup that has come in this seems like it's a really good, really good value. And even some of the skincare has been not horrific. All right, last day, Christmas day, day 25. Oh my goodness, where is it? Is there no day 25? Is that it for Advent? I guess so. Well, there you have it. Only, am I missing one? I guess there's no day 25. Bummer. Well, anyways, <laughs> there's, those are the last two days of Advent. Yeah, I really enjoyed this calendar, you guys. It's been a lot of fun. Um, I totally recommend getting one if you're into beauty advent calendars next year. Um, they sell out pretty quickly when they first launch. They're, this is from YesStyle, for, for those of you who don't remember when I got it or, or didn't watch that video. But yeah, YesStyle um, releases these, and I think they're really, really popular because it's sold out really quickly. Oh, side note, this is the Candlelight Company limited edition limited edition Christmas tree farm. This was a like uh, clearance dealio, not clearance, but they had a, like a flash deal on these candlelight holiday scents a while back at Kroger. It was like $2. This is actually pretty good, the Christmas tree farm. So yeah, I burned through my Tuscany candle ginger, gingerbread cookie. That, you guys, I hope they come out with that or some version of that again next year because that was a win. I've got my peppermint the white chocolate peppermint one that I haven't even cracked into yet, so that'll take me through January. But like I said, Christmas just went by too quickly. Like, the holiday season needs to be longer so that I can, you know, adequately get through enough Tuscany candle holiday scents in a season. So I'm, I think I'm contemplating pushing the start date next year back earlier for the decorating, but we'll see. I don't make, I don't wanna make promises. <laughs> Skincare update, I obviously just got out of the shower and this morning I put on a good layer of my uh, Dermatology sunscreen and uh, then I obviously reapplied it when I got out of the shower. And over it, I applied this Claire um, Tinted Facial Sunscreen. I showed this in a vlog a while ago. It's cruelty-free mineral sunscreen because I finished up my Color Science Mineral Face Shield. So I'm gonna make my way through this. And I really like it. It's a little bit darker than the Color Science one um, and it kind of reminds me of the MD Solar Science tinted mineral sunscreens. It's really nice. I really like it. SPF 40, water resistant, uh, has like a nice buttery kind of consistency. Um, so it just kind of goes on very smooth. It's not shrieky. I really like it. Um, so yeah, that's what I've got on and la di da -dee. Let's go look at the tree. Oh, there she is in all her glory. My apartment is actually a little bit of a disaster right now. I apologize for that. But I don't think I've like updated you guys on some of my ornaments. My cauliflower is one of my favorites. And uh, last year a viewer sent me these adorable Lennox 12 Days of Christmas. And I, I love those because last year I purchased, or I was given, I think my mom got me, this Lennox uh, holiday ornament set. It was the three, three ornaments. It was this angel and a few others. Uh, yeah, this cute little snowman. And there's one other one somewhere anywhere. Um, we'll find it in a moment. But yeah, you can see the little 12 days of Christmas. They're so adorable. Oh, and I had forgotten that I, was gifted that last year from one of you all. So it was really a treat to open it up, open it up and put them out on the tree. So yeah, and then I bought this earlier this year um, from Hobby Lobby, it's just a mushroom in honor of Four Siggy. And then a viewer sent me this cute little baby Totoro and I just opened this, it's a glitter ballerina. So it still has a little um, card on it. I didn't want to take it off. And my mom got me this this year from, I think, Hobby Lobby. Kind of go with the white, white and whatnot. Oh, and I love this, if you are sent me. Home is where we are together. Sunscreen and subscribe 2019 in Texas. I, I just love that. So yeah, I love, I love my tree. And little 12 drummers drumming. 
So yeah, oh, one other update, holiday decor wise. Where did I, I wanted to show you that other Lennox though before I go bopping around. There's the pickle. <laughs> Here's the other holiday Lennox. It's a cute little Santa with a star. But I wanted to show you guys another thing. Yeah, I don't know if you noticed this when I was doing the uh, advent calendar and that footage, but a viewer sent me this cute little um, bobble for going over candles. And with it was this adorable wreath that matches uh, Margot's dress. So it's like she's holding it. I just love that with her cute little holiday van back there and Willa. So we're gonna have to change their outfits once the season's over. Oh, speaking of which, yeah, I got Margot a new little outfit um, for after the holidays, this little brown dress with a cute little um, like jacket. Cause I have a green jacket kind of like that that I've been wearing lately. It's been perfect for this particular season weather wise here. And she got these cute new little shoes. Can you guys see those focus? Yeah, they've got the cute little studs on them. So yeah, she'll have a new outfit to put on after the holidays, but this one I really love, uh, her Christmas outfit. I'm also wearing my Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer Christmas socks. Here's Rudolph, he's there on the side. Your little earrings are really <laughs> pretty. Did you show everybody your earrings? Yeah, I did. Somebody's excited for Christmas. <laughs> Tidy bow. You got a haircut and everything. <laughs> Look at him. I'm so excited. Santa's coming. Santa's coming. Yes. Have you been a good boy? Are you on the nice list? Uh -huh. <laughs> Hi, Mom. Hi, everybody. Happy Christmas Eve. You Happy holidays. Nice. Little Christmas Eve outfit. <coughs> the sweater oh, dress. Got my shoes. <laughs> Looks nice. All right, well we're gonna we're gonna head out. The tree looks nice. Oh, excuse me. Look what I got in. Oh, how cute! Ray Dunn mugs. Oh, I like those. Bubble water in it. Aren't they cute? Those are cute. Ooh, and you made the uh, gingerbread. I love these. Your mom has been making dough. those. I've got more dough and we can make more. Oh good. My mom has been making these every year since I was little. They're my favorite. <laughs> Tabby Bo. Tabby Bo.
Ivy. Hey, everybody. How's your, uh, how does your mug uh, fare in terms of its, it's drinkability? It's, it's nice. I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna make myself some peppermint tea to have in the naughty mug. <laughs> oh, I'm the nice mug. I'm the nice mug. Speaking of nice, the uh, the uh, one of the, a few of the houses that we went by. I don't know if you noticed when you were driving, but they have these pretty ornament lights hanging in the tree that dim in sort of a, a unique way. And I just edited that footage on the vlog, and, and it looks really neat. Vlog. Yeah, it looks yeah. really neat. No. Yeah, the... I was busy trying to drive. They really do a good job on their house lights here. You can actually take a bus tour around, too. Yeah. See it, which I think would be better, because you can actually see... Yeah. You don't have the stress of driving. Yeah. But I'm not sure how much it costs. It is. It's a topless bus. Or <laughs> topless bus. <laughs> You know, you sit yeah, on the road. a double decker bus. Nice. Yeah, it's that would nice be nice. The weather is. Mom's watching Elf. <laughs> and uh, I'm watching Elf and drinking from my naughty mouth. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I'm going to. My mom made us dinner, and we're gonna eat in a little while. But I'm going to whip up. I got these uh, kasabi crisps on Amazon a while ago. I think I'm going to make these as little appetizers. They're basically um, like cassava flour crisps. Anyways, I thought I would have those and then I have um, the uh, tree line cheese here. Uh, it's nut cheese. I thought it would be nice to spread on top. What's that? I got Tavi another dish. Oh, cute. Yeah, he has two now. You got those at Home Goods? Yeah. Yeah, they just opened that Home Goods. That's where I got my redone mugs. Yeah. Yeah. They pretended to have his little supper. Oh, those are cute. Spectrum. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna make myself a tea. You don't need the microwave right now, do you? No. Should I turn that off? Yeah, they might copy on yeah. Never know when YouTube is gonna put us in the naughty list. <laughs> yeah, I'm just making another a cup of this Twinings peppermint cheer. This is really good. My new favorite holiday tea. I tell you, I really have some wins at Kroger with the yeah. flowers. Yeah. Let me. Isn't it cute though? It's like it. a woodland. Oh, that woodland is cute. Woodland succulent. Oh, that's really cute. Yeah, I, I fell in love with it. Oh, that's they cute. Let me come over on. there so I can show better. Oh, yeah, that's really cute with the little berries. Yeah. And I like the yeah. container. It's so cute. Kroger, I'm telling you, they've got some wins. Yeah, they, they really do. I hope, I hope I don't kill the poor thing. <laughs> well, your Christmas cactus is doing well. Yeah, it's got a lot of buds on it now. Did you grow a little bit? They very, very nice. Mom's doing some doggy gift wrapping. But I tell you, getting these out of the saran wrap is harder than it looks. I really wrapped them up. Cling wrap, saran wrap. Yeah, that's one of those things that you know by the brand name. It's marketing for you. 
It's like prescription drugs. Most people just know the the brand name of the prescription drug. Oh, it's not the generic. I guess the generic of saran wrap is clean wrap. Plastic wrap. Ah, there we go. Yeah, the on iHerb you can get this Twinings holiday tea set, tea pack. It's um the peppermint cheer, this um Christmas tea, the black tea. I have not had that yet. And then it comes with winter spice. And then it comes with like a holiday berry tea. Winter spice is really good. The holiday berry is also decent. Um, it's good, but it's not my favorite of the of the four. And then I love that peppermint, which is what I'm having now. And I totally recommend getting the um, Better Stevia, I think it is, peppermint cookie ste Stevia drops and sweetening it with that, it's really good. Those Stevia drops are all, also really good and um, hot chocolate. You just get some unsweetened hot, unsweetened cocoa powder, put it in a little non-dairy milk that's heated up, and then sweeten it with the peppermint stevia drops. Oh, it's really good. I'm doing crouching tiger hidden, hidden elf here. That's good. All right, so I finally got these unwrapped. Here's what they look like in the flesh. Kind of looks like insulation. Asbestos. All right, so I just smeared a little of this Rayo's uh, homemade sensitive <laughs> sauce onto the kasabi kasabi crisps, and then I daubed a little of the tree line nut cheese. It doesn't really melt, but um, so I kind of tried to smear it into the tomato sauce because it does taste really good when it's mixed with tomato sauce. Um, and then I just topped it with some spinach. So I'm going to put that in 360 for, I think, eight minutes. Tybee's going to go out to the bathroom. I just got this hair band. Um, isn't it cute? It's by this um, brand company called Headbands for Hope. They are a charity for sick children. Yeah, it's called Headbands for Hope. Um, and a portion of the proceeds... For every item sold, it goes to a child with cancer. Um, so yeah, it's a really good cause. And uh, they're really nice hair bands. I got this um, gold velour one. And then I also got a gray one. I'll show you guys. Yeah, I also got this gray one. How cute is that? What can to my little uh, kasabi pizzas came out looking good. I just Popped them out of the oven. They got kind of a nice brownish hue to them. And then this is a uh, stuffed cabbage my mom made from Brand New Vegan. Yes, it's the second time we've had that. I yeah, recommend. it's I gooder. It's a very good recipe. Did you show it? I, I showed a peek, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's really good. Cool. Stuffed cabbage. I made uh, black beans. And then I didn't season the beans, but I made seasoning. Oh, okay. You can put that in. Oh, all right. And then I made these ginger orange carrots, which oh, might that'll be tasty. Up. That'll be tasty. And we've got cauliflower. Not cauliflower. Uh, uh, oh, cucumber. Cucumber. That's what that is. Oh, don't say the c word. This is Tybee's new. New thing. Whenever I have one of those mini cucumbers, it's a rule Tybee has m made. He's trained yeah, me. I do have some of those. Anytime I have I a, don't tell him. anytime I have one of those baby cucumbers, I have to give him the last little nubbin of each one. He's rather adorable chewing on a cucumber. It's, and it's then precious. And do you want me to get some lettuce out, or you're going to handle that? Um, whatever you. If you, you do feel it. the urge to lettuce, then no, go I for don't. It. Okay, I'll do it. Let us carry on. I like this uh, hair band. Oh, good. This kasabi stuff is really good. Yeah, this is delicious. You, I just tried it. You like it? Yeah. It's nice and light. It's really good with the tomato sauce kind of soaks into it. I like it. the texture of it. This would be, it's like a pizza. Yeah, it's really good. 
I totally recommend this. I'll list it down below for you guys. I got it on Amazon. Fortuna Kasabi Artisan Flatbreads. Yeah, it's really good. They are... Yeah, they're really good. Key number two here. I like these mugs because they're... The way they're molded... I don't know if you can see that. There's like a little bit of a flatness to where your lip goes. It's really nice. Yeah, at first I thought, oh, that's going to be kind of wonky to drink from, but um, yeah. your mouth lands right on this flat bar. Yeah. And then I keep being reminded that <laughs> I'm the naughty one. So this looks really good. I just made a, kind of a mixed medley salad here with those stuffed cabbage leaves. They're so good. I'll put the recipe down below. Is it the same recipe you did last time? The um, mm -hmm. brand new vegan? Brand new vegan. Yeah. So black beans, cucumber, carrots, cucumber, and this thing is really good. Yeah, I got a really big piece of it. Yeah. Um, the brand new vegan has uh, a video on mm -hmm. YouTube yeah. for these, and then he, he also has on his blog, he lists the ingredients. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah I'll, list, I'll link that down below for you guys. Come here, you have to be in the Christmas Eve. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I think I'm going to wrap up the vlog here. I hope you all have a wonderful Christmas. Maybe I can get this up on Christmas Day for you guys. That would be fun. Um, so enjoy yeah, there's your... good footage of the lights, too. Yeah, enjoy your, enjoy your holiday. And Tybee wants to give you a Christmas wiggle. <laughs> uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Share it with your friends. And as always, awesome. don't forget, sunscreen and subscribe. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye.